really wide variety oh, of paint yeah, graphics yeah, options for CBO for 2020. Like, yeah, I think oh everybody can find something wow. that's going to speak to Make Harley great again. <laughs> On the big screen, I'm going to be sitting. What a beast, what a broken elbow, you know? It's very cool, huh? I was wrong, I was totally wrong. It's not Yeah, it's about an hour 15 before the big event, the big uh, reveal, Harley's big reveal. I'm on my way to John's. Let's make ourselves some popcorn and watch. I'm really excited, really, really excited, actually. You know, everybody, uh, like the online the community, like, uh, I mean, YouTube and wherever you go, people are talking and putting out videos. Even I did put out 2022 models and such a, a big hype a big hype about it and you know kudos to uh, harley davidson they ran this campaign beautifully beautifully with all you know as he got closer closer and closer to the date till to today there were more and more leaks people speculating and putting out video and the word in the community every everything was about the 2022 reveal and uh, new models and you know what? They did a great, great job with getting everybody hyped and excited about the reveal. Uh, obviously, everybody has their own uh, their own wishes and their own thoughts and hopes. Uh, me too. I I personally want a certain model to come out because I that's one of the bikes that I want, and I personally also want to, to buy one. So that's why I'm hoping for it. And of course, there's what I want for Harley because I want Harley to succeed. I want Harley to thrive as a company. So some people believe that uh, you should retain uh, and, and cater to the, you know, to the current customers that want better and improved touring bikes, uh, which uh, I, I definitely can see that. And other people say, no, let's, let's get as many, many new uh, customers, younger customers, younger riders into, into the Harley brand, which I can understand that as well. I say one thing, there's so many experts out there. We're all, we all think we're experts, you know? We all think we know best. That's why there's a very good CEO for the last year or two that do, that's done a great, great job for Puma in the past. And that's why they brought him to, you know, to, to revive, to revive the Harley brand, to bring it up, make Harley great again. So I'm sure he's doing a great job and he's got a, a team of experts that know a little bit better than us, although we want to think that we know better than anybody than everybody else. But they know what they're doing. Leave the strategy to them. And very soon we're gonna see what they have for us for 2022. I'm really excited. What's up, Mr. Holy Shift? Oh, what are you doing? Are you ready? We, are we supposed to be uh I gotta get the workout in, man? I gotta make sure silverbacks tamed I can handle it you know yeah are we supposed to uh, be having popcorn now in front of the one team? hour one hour one hour to go I'm psyched I'm really excited dude I'm very psyched I can't <laughs> wait I built the gym as soon as COVID started what two years ago yeah almost two years ago gyms were shut down and I built this uh, gym in the backyard that, that's where I work out all, all day long <laughs> he does finger curls. <laughs> All right, this is Sandy benching a tremendous amount of weight. <laughs> oh yeah, buddy. That's I think that's a world record for a chicken. <laughs> he's shrug he's struggling with the bar. Help me up. <laughs> Getting all ready on the big screen. I'm gonna be sitting over here. What you doing? Yeah, I didn't have breakfast. You wanna cook something for me? Yeah. What are you gonna cook? I'm gonna make some eggs. Nice. Who said he can't cook? Gotta keep it healthy, guys. Gotta keep it healthy. <laughs> We're only getting older. We're not getting any younger. Low carbs, high protein. That's, look at that. How many eggs, dude? Wow. I take out the yolks, mm. my boy. Look at that, one breakfast. 500 eggs. There's a lot of chickens. Right? Two for me, 498 for him. There's a lot of chickens. 1022. 
38 minutes to go, but but who's counting, huh? Can't wait. Yeah. Some yummy stuff for me over there. I don't know what it is. It's Taylor Ham, my boy. Shh. I can't let my Jewish friends know. Oh. Look what John just got. Look what John just got. Look at this beautiful shirt. Here, let me show him. Oh. Harley Davidson, Israel. Tel Aviv dealership. Beautiful. Got it on my website, www.holyshift.us. Get some. Good. Low carb. Low carb. Five, five gram of carb per wrap. Wrap pita. Okay, done. Let's. It's twenty five minutes to go. Just finished breakfast. Okay, sit over here so I can see. Setting up. We got fourteen minutes to go. Countdown, countdown. We're actually setting up, setting up our little studio over here. How we're gonna be watching, filming, streaming, responding. That's good right there. All for you. All for this Harley event. Look how many. 659 waiting. We've got uh, 12 minutes to go. I bet it's going to jump into the thousands once uh, once we get closer. Yeah, closer, definitely. huh? Yeah. Eight minutes. Eight minutes to go. Nerve wracking. Six minutes to go. I'm going live. Live, live, live. Uh, Amsterdam. Here we go. Here we go. Alright, here we go. Here we go. You guys see it? We are kick stands up on the dawn. Represents a national champion. That's badass. That's a national champion. Crazy, huh? Beautiful. Says this is a proper fing race bike. <laughs> that is so cool. What a beast, what a broken elbow, you know. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Let's see it. ST. Road Glide ST and Street Glide ST. It's very cool, huh? Not yeah, yet. so far. Let's see. CVO lineup. Really wide variety of paint and graphics options. Really wide variety oh, of paint and graphics know, options for CBO for 2020. Like I think oh everybody can find something wow. that's going to speak to them. Wow. They're all very unique and different from one another. Wow. The orange is amazing. That's, that's very cool. I love that. Black and yellow. Your 22 CBO was to interject some more color. As well as custom paint techniques so that you know our customers come to love. That is beautiful. That is beautiful. Some of those really wow. saturated colors. Uh, not that one. That one is that's that's nice beautiful too. as well. The greatest opportunity. That's that's nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's really so we nice. And work closely with Gunslinger. Gunslinger is a company that's wow. been in our CBO arsenal. And and we just add to it that color, that color, that orange and black. Yeah, leather, nice suite of technology on the motorcycles as well. Whether it's heated seat, heated grip, oh, audio, the stitch, the stitching, and the leather on the seats. The Rockford Stage One audio system onto the limit. Okay, we're at the uh, the gear, the apparel, the clothing part, taking a short break. Up till now, it was live, and I gotta tell you. Uh, the new direction they're going is amazing. It's beautiful. That loader rider ST, that was beautiful. I, I really dig it. It's like, and also the new, uh, the new and improved street glide and road glide. Wow, 117, really cool. Well, we just finished watching uh, the world premiere. Harley's world premiere was really, really exciting. As uh, well, as I it was leaked, Harley's going into the uh, performance bagger direction at this stage, and they improved the beautiful, beautiful touring baggers, the road glide, the street glide with the 117. And they put a new, smaller, sleeker front fender on it, and most important, they took care of the suspension. Went with Olin suspension to improve their current suspension that was uh, lacking. Uh, and then obviously they came out with the Lowrider ST 
which is just beautiful. It is really, really exciting to see that bike. Think about it. It's 100, 150 pounds lighter with the 117, that beautiful fairing, a smaller, more nimble uh, frame. I really can't wait to ride it and test it out. And if I like it, uh, you never know. That's it. Uh, really excited. I was like, I was totally wrong. And you know, a true man <laughs> knows to admit when, uh, when he's wrong. So yeah, guys, I was, uh, I was wrong. I was totally wrong. It's not only about the color or the paint. Harley listened to their people, listened to their riders, listened to their customers and, uh, pretty much gave them what they want. So I was wrong and Harley did a great job. And I can't wait for the next few months, quarter three, usually they come out with uh, an announcement. They did hint at the end that they're uh, going to come out with something with the Revolution engine on a, on a Sportster S or I don't know. So it was really exciting, a lot of fun. That's it for now, guys. Uh, psyched, psyched. I'm going to put this video out as soon as I can. I wonder what you guys think. That's it, guys. Watching Holy Shift, I'm Sandy. Until the next video, guys. Peace out.